Hello everyone, you're with Chandeep Chabra at Gulli and in this video we're going to talk about the OR function in Excel. We have done the IF, we have done the nested IF and we've also done the AND function and now we are headed towards the OR function. I hope you've also seen those videos. So the OR function in Excel uh, allows you to uh, test conditions but not necessarily all of the conditions should be true. Let's take a look at this example. We have uh, different people uh, and we have to check that do they have any of the uh, government proof of identity or not. So these are the names of people. Uh, so uh, passport, yes or no, do they have it or not? The driving license, yes or no, do they have it or not? And we are going to accept uh, the application or whatever only if uh, they have either one of the proof of identity so they should have a passport or they should have a driving license so we just have to test for either one of them being true so what is it that i'm going to do i'm going to write an or statement so equals to or or and the or statement just like the and statement allows me to write logical tests which are my conditions so my first condition is i want to check for the passport so i will move over to this cell so uh this should be equal to the yes and this should be equal to yes right so i'm just testing for two things here so the first thing is that do they have a passport or do they have a driver's license so if any one of the two conditions is true we're going to accept it otherwise we are not going to accept it so right so i'm going to press enter if you just see on this example uh, uh, miranda has got only driver's license but she has not got the passport since we are putting those conditions in the or statement we just want either one of these two conditions to be true so she this one is going to be true this cell is equal to yes that means she has the driver's license and this or statement is going to give a true result so this is true just like the and function or function is also only capable of giving you either a true or a false so if you want to go and do anything more than the true or the false you have to wrap around the or function in an if function right so how do we do that so i'm just going to go back to the or function wrap that around in the if function so this entire thing becomes my logical test or my condition this is giving me a true or false and based on that true and false i can choose to accept this is my action if true or i can choose to decline action if false so if this condition stands true i will accept it otherwise i will decline it so that's about it all of that is text so i have put that in inverted commas so press enter and put it down so all the trues have been accepted so uh, this one has got both so chris has got passport as well as a driving license so definitely a true uh, driver's license uh, victoria has only got the driver's license but since we have the or statement we just want either one of them to be you know yes so that's again true and so the application gets accepted so that was the or function in excel and if you want to follow along you can follow us on uh, facebook or twitter or you can also follow us on goodly.co.in and uh, stay tuned thank you for watching and take care bye bye